I don't know why you guys are not choosing trade school. Like seriously, why students will come all the way from India, all the way from Africa, all the way from Philippines. I don't know where you're watching me right now. Come to Canada, spend more than $20,000 on one course. You know, I'm not talking down on your program, but at the end of the day, start hustling for jobs and all that, whereby we have a trade school here. In trade school, you immediately see one thing about trade school is that on your graduation date, they are coming even before your graduation, like a month to your graduation. So there's always a program whereby a company will come over to employ. See, there is 95% chance that you will be employed at a, on the spot. See, you will, as soon as you are done, even before you are done, there are companies that will employ you, that are ready, because there's always space in trade school. And trade school is not uh maybe for men alone maybe a carpentry um, mechanic um uh, heavy duty mechanic you know or a pipeline technician so many plumbers and all that so we even have for females we have parts so parts uh technicians and all that you know what just to know each each part for each each uh, this thing you'll be the one to buy parts to know what part to buy for uh the um, for the vehicle for the for the trailers or anything so your own specialist is parts so which there are so many females and you will earn the same rate because so now you will earn the same pay with the mechanic the you know the people that they are housing that are going you know that the heavy duty mechanic the carpentry the anything so you will you will earn the same you guys are the same you are handing the same certification you hand the same certification. so now and it's an office job so you can even go for the part you know specialist so if you are someone that doesn't have the let's say uh the the, the power you know to climb to do this to go do so and apart from that there are so 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 many other courses you can do in trade school and also it's a pathway to permanent resident i believe your dream your goals is to come here to for pr it's a permanent it's a path like the best way with low crs cost you don't even need to bother about 500 crs most trade scores are 300 at worst maybe 400 yeah 300 the last um uh express entry draw is 300 so now which is the best so like i don't know and you will hand the same pay with doctors with nurses as as an duty technician like i don't want to you know start calling money or anything but let me just say you will end the same page just look at it just go to indeed uh go to job marketplace or anything look for um a a journeyman a red seed technician another arm of the hand so now you at least 60 70 per hour apart from all the other bonuses and all that so which is the best for you at least with that you will leave come and most trade school you like not your normal conventional school um you 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 start studying and all that but in trade school you will earn because you normally you're an apprentice and you're also schooling so the company you're working for you'll be paying you a normal staff to that company so like you'll be paid like every year first year second year the, your second year you're like a minimum i don't like it depends on each each uh this program for but for every duty mechanic the first year depending on the province depending on so but first i'm talking about where i am right now the first year you'll be paid at 
Africa for like 36 power. So just 36 for a first year apprentice. And the second year, 40, the third year, like 40s, 9, 50. Then the last year, you know, it did four years course. The last year you'll be earning like 60, so or 50 something because as soon as you're done, you have your journeyman certification and then you go for red seal. Then if you're a red seal, you'll be earning like 60 something, 70, depending on your experience. And one thing about trade is it's experience. A, a fresh graduate to be earning like 60, 65, depending on the co company you're working for the and the locate the province. And as you know, two years, three years, 70, 75, you know, depending. You, and as you're going, you're learning more. You, you know, for like every DT, you're learning more. You're getting so some other certification on Kumas 2, on uh, case um, uh, on uh, what's it called, on CAT, you know, so many other certification just to upgrade. You are upgrading yourself and you'll be earning more. A huge truck um duty a huge truck mechanic and more than two hundred thousand per year. So which is the hand yes, I know I'm saying this because I'm with them, I know what the hand a huge truck mechanic at in oil uh, oil sand here. Yeah. Oil sand is just in front of me here. Yeah. In oil sand here yeah, that I am right now. So hand more than two hundred thousand more than 200,000 but we don't need to start calling numbers and all that but it is the best choice for you if you're a new immigrant or you're coming here at least go for trade school and you never regret it so don't forget to like and subscribe please like and subscribe and i'll talk, and if you have any comments if you have anything to tell me you know just drop it as a comment below and um, I'll reply or do a video reply, you know, to your comments. So, and again, subscribe.